Hey guys, welcome to a brand new video to the channel. So in this video, we're going to announce two brand new Series 3 accounts while also talking about one of RuneScape 3's growing problems that's coming into the game, and that's relating to bonds. So probably a couple of weeks on Market Watch, we actually titled the Market Watch episode about it. Bonds hit 100 mil, and 100 mil was sort of the big point where when I was looking at it, I was sort of saying, look, this could start to be a problem because... A portion of the game base actually does get their membership through paying in-game cash with bonds. Now, bonds going higher and higher and money-making methods not quite following that trend could mean that it takes you longer now on average to earn a bond with in-game play. Now, if you're a max level, max count, could do the highest tier PVM, this probably won't affect you as much because you have the capabilities to earn the levels of GP needed to earn a bond at that price. However, if you're not able to do the high tier PVM, you're a lower level, you're a mid level, or possibly even looking to break from free to play, a bond which is over 100 mil is quite a challenge now. Now, even more so than that, even though the bond actually hit the 100 mil mark a couple of weeks ago, it's actually gone back up in price. So I did this as a bit of a price check a little bit earlier on, but a bond now currently, and this is on the 13th of May, is 121.7 mil, which... It's huge for a bond. I mean, even on a mid-level, could you make 120 mil in 14-day period? I think you'd struggle. Um, even with like the vast amounts of OP money-making methods, ways you can do dailies, um, it's a very much a high challenge to do. And don't get me wrong, um, coming up on the sort of bond account, there's a slight little mini-series coming up where we do a two-week period of can we earn a bond in two weeks. And that's with an account with a slightly improved stats of what we did last year when we made a bond with Prime Membership. However, now Prime Membership is gone. Um, there is no real sort of way for you to get into Membership. So that is going to be where we're going to start our first new series. Now, I mentioned it a couple of videos ago that we're possibly looking at doing something on the anniversary of the Prime Membership series. That was a series which basically started my account and really sort of gained traction with subscribers and stuff. So I wanted to do something to celebrate it after it's been a full year. However, because they've now removed Prime Membership and all the benefits of Prime Membership, what we're going to do instead is do a sort of one-off little niche mini-series where we go free-to-play and see how quick we can go and make a bond. Now, whether we do that on a episode-by-episode, episode, so for the two weeks of content, or we do apart from Market Watch, is this series. I don't know. Again, I'll put it in my community tab, which is where I put all my suggestions for series. So if you want to be involved in that, make sure you subscribe to the channel, and it will be in my community tab. You will see it whenever I put comments up which I will be doing quite a bit more lately because I'll be traveling a bit. I want to show you guys what I'm doing and stuff. But also, I'm really looking for I'm really looking for suggestions for future series or things you guys want to see. But going from free to play to a bond, 120 mil is going to be quite the task. And I'm going to impose a few things on myself as well. I don't want to be doing just less necroplasm for a couple of, well, two weeks to earn a bond. I want to make sure we have variety. I want to make sure we cater to the free to play players. I want to have enough different variety in the free to play series where it's just not hammering necromancy for two weeks to make a bond i want to show different methods and at least that way we can appease like the free to play the newer players as well that there is ways to make gp anyway i'm kind of looking forward to it. i think it's going to be harder than i think um and i think it's going to be hard either way but i think now with um how money making methods are in free to play it's going to be a real eye opener and a real challenge which i'm i'm kind of looking forward to seeing as well see how we get on with that so we'll do that on a fresh account so a fresh account we created for free to play series brand new stats brand new everything just in case you're looking to join the game again you can follow along or you can join and you can try and see if you can beat me with how quick we'll do it we'll do the challenge with in-game time with hands to see how quick we can go and make 120 mil or whatever the price the bond is by then obviously the longer it takes for me to start this series the more chance the bond's probably going to go up and really, like, the next big milestone for the bond is going to be 150 mil, which it, it could be very feasible in the next couple of weeks, maybe a couple of months. But it's going to turn into a 150 mil bond. But um, I wouldn't recommend people to, especially if you're coming from free-to-play, to use a bond for membership. It's just too much game cash, in my opinion. Um, and it really, unless you've got, like, a massive cash stack ready to go and, like, take advantage of members and members money making methods don't just buy a bond with all your cash stack you need to make sure you have some form of money anyway but that's gonna be a fun little series to do anyway and it might give us like a little fun like noob account to go and play around with i don't know it's uh, just an account for that series if we want to take it further we will do if not i'll just leave it where it is and then going on to the next series so series number two we're going to bring out is something which has been on a community tab for a little while now and that is going to be the flipping account now with an, a sort of a channel like mine which has so many money making methods we do market watch we do stuff like that I think it's about time we sort of go into the flipping way to a flipping video or a flipping series and I talk how I do it and what all my strategies are and 
just have a value of cash stack to show like it growing over time as well. I think with the way things are starting to get expensive and stuff, you have eight grand exchange slots. You need to make sure that they're working for you all the time and you're making some form of cash or you're buying something at a cheaper rate or stuff like that. And I think by having a flipping account or a flipping series, we can really sort of like show that detail just so you can really see like how I approach flipping and stuff like that. And really, one of the things which started this channel off was a flipping series we did in 07. I've always wanted to do one on RuneScape 3, but when I started to get back in RuneScape 3 and make videos again, that's when the tax system brought in. Um, and because of that, it's sort of, I weren't really keen on learning how to flip alongside it. But it won't just be quick flips, it will be doing long-term flips, investments, loads of different things. And at the minute, I'm going in it with no actual sort of end goal, um, whether it's 100 mil, a bill, whatever. But I'm just going there to make content and talk through like what I do, what my ideas are. But it's going to be pretty much a flipping only account. There'll be no combat, no skills, nothing. All it will do is sit at the Grand Exchange. And how I'm going to evaluate its GP per hour is also with hands. It's sort of like see how long we've been on the game for. So my goal there is to make the most cash per hour possible. And that shows like, look, this is how viable flipping is. But again, we're flipping. I'm not going to be sat on one item. We're going to have variety. We're going to have different items. We're going to have like try and jump in on updates and reasons why things might make more money than not and hopefully make a lot of profit by doing this as well while talking through like a lot of different things for the grand exchange and sort of following the market watch things we're spotting like with market watch we find a lot of things we point out we talk about and we comment on i think it's now a really good time to like show you guys i'm using that information i'm going after flips i'm doing stuff as well and uh, yeah, so those are my ideas for the next couple of weeks and months. Um, I'd like to get a first episode of each one out within sort of two weeks. And what I'm looking to do now in terms of like the seven day week is to have a couple of different series running and then fill the rest with like money making methods or main account stuff. So in a standard week, we'd have a market watch episode. We would have a alt episode because the alt account is now all caught up. There's no like pre-recorded videos, nothing we need to catch up on. Everything is sort of in the moment and in time. And that's why the old account might appear in like money making methods or one off videos or stuff like that. It's much more available now because I don't have to hide stats. So one old account video, one uh, flipping video, one free to play. And those are going to be like my core four videos for the week. You'll pretty much expect one of those every day of the week. And then after that, we'll look at filling all the stuff with like the main, maybe the main does something or money making methods for our seven videos a week. And even though I'm looking to be traveling, I am trying to make sure that I maintain our schedule of what kind of videos we want. And uh, yeah, I think we're doing really well this year and I wanna make sure that we still try and push the content out for you guys because I love the comments, I love the likes, I love the subscriptions. It's such a good like feeling to know you guys enjoy the videos. I wanna make sure there's enough content out for you guys and that's why I'm always looking for different things as well. So I always say in all the videos, if you have any suggestions, any things you want to see, make sure to drop in the comments because I do read them. And I do sort of take them forward to any video ideas I've got to make sure if you've got any suggestions, they're included. Or if you've got anything you particularly want to watch, we'll always aim for that. But if you are new to the channel and you um, aren't subscribed, please make sure you do subscribe. There is so much more coming. And I'm really going to be trying hard to make sure that the quality really does pick up. I'm happy with how my videos are now because we do have like that sort of talk to you kind of style. But I really want to make some of the sort of high quality of ours for free videos. There's some great creators out now who really raised the bar and I want to be one of those to sort of do that as well. So I'm going to be learning a lot, going to be trying to try a few different little things and there might be um, something along the lines of a series coming up which might push me to edit in a slightly different style anyway. But uh, yes, hope you guys are looking forward to it again. I know we've done a couple of ramble videos over the past couple of weeks but there's a lot of information I want to get out just so it doesn't catch you guys by surprise. But two new series coming soon. The big news is as well, a bond is now 120 mil which... It's huge in the grand scheme of things and it's really going to change what a lot of the player base does, but it's given me sort of an insight on maybe we target some more bond oriented content to help those players out, like some ideas of how to sustain a bond, how to make a bond in 14 days and all that sort of stuff can be stuff which we bring in the channel and take you guys along with us on how I would do it, how I would approach it. And uh, maybe you guys got different ways and you guys can let me know in the comments, but I hope you're looking forward to it. If you are, please make sure you give me a like. Subscribe to the channel, loads of content coming. We're going to try for seven days a week. I think I can do it. I'm going to try and do it and uh, we'll see how we go. But thank you guys for watching once again. Hope you have enjoyed and looking forward to it. I'll see you guys very soon in the next video.